CM4D Classic is the original CM4D reporting interface. It is used for creating report templates and viewing your data inside these templates. The templates are highly customizable and extremely flexible. Whether you use them for simple data monitoring, statistical process control, or gauge r and studies. CM4D Classic allows for very detailed reporting. Focus on the main window pane on the right hand side of the screen. Here we have a report for a Decklet assembly. A typical template contains a 3D CAD image and annotations displaying data which are attached to the image by leader lines. These annotations are automatically associated with the features they describe. By using the 3D tools you can rotate the part, pan it, and zoom in and out. Notice that the annotations will stay attached to the part as the image is manipulated. The annotation object can hold as much or as little information as desired, and can take any size or position within the template you deem appropriate. A variety of annotations are available in CM4D, such as text boxes, charts, tables, and graphs. All the basic SPC charts are available for selection. None of the data you see is stored in the annotations themselves. CM4D annotations display information from the database and calculate statistics on the fly based on the variables they contain. Double clicking on this text box allows you to view and edit the variables it contains. In this case the annotation will display the associated features label. It will also calculate and display the mean, range, and standard deviation for the feature. Variables are selected from a drop-down menu. Other dimensional characteristics, such as X, Y, or Z axis, or even diameter, can also be calculated by CM4D and displayed as either actuals or deviations. A template serves as a means of viewing the data stored in the CM4D database at any point in time, whether it is real-time data or any amount of historical data that is stored in the database. Once a report template is created, it can be populated with your data and printed, emailed, or saved. A single template can contain multiple sheets. This top row of tabs shows your available sheets. Each sheet can be a different report. The sheets can further be arranged into sheet sets. This bottom row of tabs shows your available sheet sets. A CM4D template uses three pieces of information to present your reports. The first is a part image file, typically exported from CAD, like the one you see here. The second piece of information is your nominal or theoretical part data and the third is your measurement results or actual data. Both the nominal and measurement results data are stored in the CM4D database using the Datasmith application. Focus on the left window pane where you see a representation of your database in a tree structure. Here you are connected to the CAR database. This database contains a large number of parts. The 
query you see here shows only the data for the Decklet assembly. As you can see, the Decklet assembly has 32 features, or measurement points, and is showing 30 samples for each feature. To display a list of the features, simply click the plus sign under Features. Each of these features can be any number of feature types, including point, whole, slot, midpoint, variance, distance, reference, gap, and flush. The feature editor can be used to edit each of these features with respect to its properties such as nominals or spec limits. Samples are loaded by simply double-clicking on samples. This template is set to load the last 30 samples. You can choose samples in a variety of different ways, such as by sample label. Finally, hitting the Finish button loads the desired samples in the CM40 template main window. Creating annotations for every feature is quite simple. You can use the Auto Report function to propagate this annotation for every feature on the part. You can change many other properties of annotations to customize them to your liking. CM4D can trigger alarms if any one of the samples for a given feature is out of spec. Right clicking on an out of spec point gives you the option of assigning a cause to the bad data. You can select a cause from the list or create a new cause. Checking the Mask Data checkbox will exclude this point from your statistical calculations. You can also define what is considered unreasonable data. Using Datasmith, unreasonable data can then be masked automatically. When you return to the chart, you will see the cause label for the bad data point on the top of the plot space. You will also see an X representing the point, showing that it has been excluded from your statistical calculations. In addition, CM4D allows you to delete the sample altogether. Simply right-click the sample in the left window pane and click Delete. this sample will no longer be in the database. Another feature available in CM4D Classic is the export data function. This feature allows you to output selected data displayed in the CM4D report to an external data file 
in a number of different file formats. This file can easily be opened in another application for further analysis. CM4D is not only a reporting tool. It is also a sophisticated data analysis tool, offering the capabilities to calculate your process control limits, track engineering changes, and maintain a history of shifts in your process. CM4D offers a measurement system analysis wizard. This will walk you through the process of performing a gauge R&R study. CM4D's alignment toolset allows you to create subroutines to reanalyze your data based on a user-defined 321 datum schema.